So we're just going to draw some eyes, different sizes to see which one's the best. I hope this design works. It should. Because it looks like a well, it looks like a human. Research. Yeah, research said that like if you stare at them, they won't swoop you. So hopefully the whole eye idea will work. Because the aluminium one worked a little bit, we've put eyes on the helmet. Because when we researched, we said that it, someone, it looks like someone's looking at the magpie, it scares them off. So we've got two big ones on the back of it. And then we've put all little ones around it as well, just so it looks a bit more consistent. So like a pattern, so people will wear it. What did we discover from this design? Last time I did it and the magpie didn't swoop me and then Carla did it and it brief, briefly swooped her but it didn't actually like hit the helmet. And we think that's because it saw the eyes and so that's why it got yeah, scared. Yeah, it kind of like eyes. swooped then, down but then flew away again. And then the even. third time it didn't even swoop but you can see it was up in the tree up there. So do you think this design is a success? Definitely. Yes. And it's visually appealing, so we think a lot of people would wear it as well. What did you learn learn from this design challenge? That um, magpie season is a real problem for kids at my school. Yeah, and they just need to be aware of like that there are magpies swooping them, and yeah. they can stop the magpies swooping them by wearing certain helmets. It's like a real that. safety concern during this time of the year. So we've decided that it would be a real advantage if um, bicycle companies could implement. Just like this one, that would um, be a simple but very visually appealing helmet that kids could wear during magpie season.